Everyone told me that my cinema was not nice. Not it's nice. nice. That's a lie. <laughs> Hi. Hi! Hi guys! My name is Sajid, I'm from Pakistan. My name is Yasmin, I'm from Morocco. I'm from Kazakhstan, my name is Zaydana. I'm from Russia, and my name is Alyona. Hi guys, my name is Sanki, and I'm from West Africa, Nigeria. Hi guys, I'm Shalina, and I'm from Congo. What is your favorite Malaysian breakfast food? Never tried many Malaysian breakfast before. Uh... Breakfast? Bread with paya? Like if I've got something to do, I think I'll have a nasi lemak. Wait, nasi lemak is a breakfast? I've never tried a nasi lemak. Really? What? No. Everyone told me that nasi lemak was not nice. Bruh. It's nice! That's a lie! Today we'll be having you try a different breakfast of each race. Shall we bring on the first course? Mushy, mushy fried. I've never seen anything like this before though. Yeah, me neither. I think it's like you eat this and then just take a sip of that. It would be better than dipping it, huh? Tastes like corn chicken. <laughs> so that is called yu tiao. It's something like a Chinese donut. It's like dough and it's fried. And inside the bowl is soya bean milk. Okay, what is this first? <laughs> this is lo mai gai. It is steamed guna sticky rice with some meat. Commonly chicken. It's too sticky. Yeah, too yeah. Okay. For us, rice is yeah. separate piece by piece. This yeah. one is a bit too sticky. You can, see, you can tell, but there is a spice. I like it. It's good. Heavy. It's good. It, it's like it's it's deceivingly good. It was not like, what I expected. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> agreed. <laughs> Do it. But like, if you eat this stuff every day, your stomach's gonna burn, you know? That's actually a taro cake. Taro cake? Taro cake. It's a taro, it's a kind of like yam almost, right? Mm -hmm. It's like yam, but they turn it into like that little cake. Oh, I like the sauce. I like it. Yeah, I, I like this one too. What you guys ate were very common Chinese breakfast dishes. Those were all Chinese foods. Really? Breakfast, huh? This is breakfast, yes. Would you eat this? Seven I, I in the morning? I will not eight, eat this. No, right? This for maybe. Breakfast. Maybe. I think this is too heavy for breakfast. I can eat this one for dinner. This looks dangerous. I think you should try this first. Here you go. Mm, no, that's for you. First one, what you're looking at in the middle there is nasi dagang. Dagang, not daging, right? No, dagang. It's a Malaysian dish that consists of rice steamed in coconut milk, fish curry, and other ingredients like pickled cucumber, carrots, and stuff like that. Mmm. I love it. The, the, the sauce is it's kind of sweet, but at the same time, it's nice. It's full, the flavor. Together with curry and the rice. This one oh. is expensive. Can it's I not have this? It's all vinegary and salty. Actually, I don't want to scare you. You can have it first and then. You already scared me. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. It's like dumpling. Oh, okay. There's so much green, like, you know, you know when you eat it on cooked leaves? That's what I feel. It's not bad. It, look, it tastes like pasta. It's weird. Yeah, the colorful things are called. It looks like the fisherman's neck. I mean, see, it's like, you know when you get a highlighter and you just spill the ink and it's like neon orange. Like, can you see that? It's good. Cool. They are mixing the mix. Mixes. But yeah, that's what happens in Malaysia, actually. You can find Chinese dishes mixed mm -hmm. with Indian dishes. You can find this. All the food you just tried is Malay. All of it. Even this is Malay? Yes. Wow. Yes, if you go to the, especially the east coast of Malaysia, Turugadu, places like that, you will find a lot of dishes like that, you know, with lime and oh. you know, fresh veggies and greens. For lunch, I would have this and this one. Oh, this one definitely. Really yeah. light, fresh tasting. It looks like a Nigerian. What? Bread? How do you call it the thing that you eat with egg Oh, suji? that's like a suji, a swallow. Right? Right, so what that is a puri actually, and the sauce inside the bowl is chutney and dal. This is Indian food. Why didn't you like the sauce? What's wrong with the sauce? Too, too sour, too salty, it tastes like twan. What's wrong? It tastes like twan. That is an appam, and next to it there should be some form of a coconut milk. Coconut oh, milk? Oh, okay. It tastes like susu kalapa. It's like a Chinese pao, man. Yeah? This is like similar to Kazakh food. Usually we take bread and we put it in it and we eat. It's not, it's not sweet. Mm. It's not... I don't like it. It's not sour. You know, it's just existing. <laughs> <laughs>
course, this is Indian breakfast. So it's Appam Puri and Idli, and they mix it with all the curries normally. Mm. It's very normal at breakfast, you order a few of those. Mm. Moroccan food is really different than this. <laughs> it's really different, yeah. We should probably try Moroccan food next. How did you find the experience of eating all the different races of food? Satu Malaysia. Oh. I thought Malaysian food is bad. It changed my mind today. Especially <laughs> the Malaysian, the second one. Yeah, it was good. Malay food. Yeah. Which one would you prefer for breakfast? Indian is my sweet. favorite. Yeah. Sweet? Yeah. yeah. Indian. I only found a breakfast that I like in the Indian. Mm, okay. Yeah. Malay, Indian. Same thing now. I think one of each. So it's more like a mix. I love the tarake. I absolutely love the tarake. Thank you guys so much for watching. Yeah, and guys, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Warden Buzz. Bye bye!